I am. Morning of September 20th, 2017. Shameless and bellow over there. But uh, pack my pack my tent up here. And we are headed into Sierra City this morning. Watching the sun come up. Look at the view we have here. Just spectacular. <laughs> what a beautiful morning. Oh my goodness. I'm all packed up here. The trail's just right here. That's where I had my tent last night. It's a little before 7 o'clock. I'm on the trail. Headed towards Sierra City for some breakfast. <laughs> I think we have close to 10 miles to do. I have to knock off these 10 miles real quick and then have breakfast in town. I can't wait. It's pretty damn cold again today. Whew. I camped at mile 1443.9. Beautiful view there. Yeah, I think this whole area is probably my favorite part in, in Northern California so far. Absolutely beautiful. So many little lakes and so many trails. The views are amazing. Oh boy, it's a chilly one. <laughs> I heard it from two people actually that we're supposed to get some snow tomorrow. It is definitely cold enough to get snow. It's right around freezing, so. I'm here at the Sierra Buttes Trailhead. PCT just continues in here. See the switchbacks going all the way down.
there's a big descent down into the towns. It's still cold. The eyes are just a water in there. And I do have gloves this on this for this trip. But and yesterday night I made them nicely accessible uh, in one of my tent pockets. I just threw them in there. So that I'd be just grabbing this morning and go. But I rolled up my tent with the gloves inside of it and I threw my tent inside my pack down at the bottom. So I really don't want to stop and pull those out just for a few miles left. I think it's probably about, I don't know, four miles maybe, four or five miles. I had a little over 10 miles. I started the day so to get to Sierra City where I have my resupply box and I'll probably have some breakfast there. You now if I can't get a hold of the Quincy post office it won't forward my shoes to Lake Tahoe then I'll have to hitchhike all the way into Quincy yet today. That's going to be my first thing that I do, is try to get a hold of the post office and see if they will do that. Hopefully they do, that way I don't have to go all the way to Quincy. But if they don't, that's fine too, I guess. I, I don't mind hitchhiking at all. I always meet somebody cool. <laughs> what a view. Such a... Which is such a spectacular area. Oh my goodness. Clouds are pretty awesome today too. The trail just goes over there and keeps switching back. Keeps dropping down. See a road way down there. Probably supposed to be a parking lot or something. Not sure where the trail will lead us, but dropping down quite a bit still. This here is the switchback spring, September 20th today, and it's flowing real well. I'm almost down by the road that leads to Sierra City. Man, and there's been a lot of switchbacks coming down from the the campsite we had at uh, the Sierra Buttes, way up high. Yeah, what a, what a long descent. <laughs> so glad I don't have to go up this. It's actually kind of steep too, in sections. Yeah, so many switchbacks. That roaring river down there is just getting louder and louder too. All I can think of is breakfast. <laughs> Some scrambled eggs and toast and coffee. Bacon. Oh, it's gonna be good. Maybe even a slice of pie or something if they have. I 
Can't wait to get down there. <laughs> it's always exciting getting into town. Hasn't been very long since we were in Belden, but... I've also been pushing myself quite a bit the last three days, so... Kind of almost a day ahead. With just averaging 20 miles a day, or if that's what I was going to do, so... Yay, finally down at the road. <laughs> Looks like the trail goes straight over. Sierra so City, one and a half miles down the road here. Oh, we all just had breakfast at the Red Moose Cafe. I headed over to the country store to pick up my resupply. 